Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Sita Ramamurtipal and today we'll be talking about ecogenic intracardiac focus. I'm sure a lot of time when women go for ultrasound in the first trimester or in the second trimester anatomy scan, they are told that the heart, the baby's heart, there is a bright spot which is commonly referred as a ecogenic intracardiac focus. And then all hell breaks loose and they all get very worried. But trust me, ecogenic intracardiac focus is only a bright muscle, papillary muscle that's calcified and it appears as a bright spot on the scan. So it is actually a normal variant. It does not mean that the baby is abnormal or the baby's heart is abnormal or the baby's heart has got a, a defect or a hole in the heart. It is just a bright prominent muscle which appears as a spot on ultrasound. Unfortunately, women and their family get very anxious about it and they think that the baby has a heart problem but usually these ones are very benign and they don't cause any problems to the heart. It is considered as a soft marker for uh, the baby having a chromosomal abnormality but actually it is so common it is almost seen in almost 1 in 20 to 1 in 30 pregnancies and it is so common and it doesn't increase your risk as, as such if it is isolated. It doesn't increase your background risk of having a baby with Down syndrome. So if you have a baby with isolated ecogenic intracardiac focus with all other features are normal, you can be reassured that there is absolutely no problem with this baby. Of course, your, if your combined FTS is low risk, and these spots or ecogenic focus, they tend to disappear in the pregnancy or even after delivery, they tend to disappear. They don't cause any problems to the baby at all. Sometimes if you're really concerned, you may have an, you know, some people might recommend an echocardiography, but as such, pure isolated ecogenic intracardiac focus does not warrant any further investigations if everything else is normal with the baby. Thank you.